Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the world of Risk Global Domination. I am Kilted. I'm a competitive player in Risk Online. And today I'm live streaming, and everybody's trying to snipe my lobby. No joke, I kicked like six people that kept rejoining and trying to snipe me. So I joined somebody else's lobby, and we invaded a fixed Alcatraz game. That's right. Oh, doggy time. Uh... I mean, White's going to roll off that, right? And he goes right before me. This is like asking for candy. Oh, baby. That's got to be the candy, right? Oh, yeah. That has to... Oh, yes. Yes. It's all stupid. It's already terrible. We're playing Fixed Capitals on the map. Alcatraz. Alcatraz. Hard AI. Fog on. Blizzard's on. No portals. No alliances. Fixed. Alcatraz. Blue has a god cap. Purple didn't cap here. Blue didn't cap here. I mean... Is there going to be a fight for the right side of the board? I would presume... Black? Blue? There is a chance that everything is going to go my way. I already foresee this game. Somebody's going to be capped back here and screw me over. But if they didn't... Oh my god, this game's going to be sick. Dude, this is a hundred percent, a thousand percent of kill to trap. No, no, I, I was actually trying to host an Alcatraz lobby, and I had like the same four or five names that kept joining, and I kept kicking them. Oh! You see what I'm talking about? If I'm honest, I could probably just leave that. Totally Spanish bald guy tipped $10.69. Don't even say it. Hippo and Chain can't sit in a tree. Chain is too fat. That was rude. Um. I mean, I. Probably I'd be safe, right? It would be suicide for purple to roll me. Yeah. Wow. Wow. The bottle fortify back if you don't... Yeah, that's the thing, Leona, is like, that's cheap. But if I take it and leave a three, the bot hits it back. But if I make it two weak, purple tries to ram dingle me. Like, I could have lost three troops hitting the two stack, right? So I like, I'm trying to calculate all the different things that could have happened there. I think ultimately I landed on the right choice and I didn't lose any troops on the two, which let me do an 8-5 split. Whew! That sounded like something Doomian would say. I haven't seen Doomian in a minute. I bet you if I start playing Catan again, he'll come back real quick. This is a disgusting game already. This is so beautiful. I kind of want to see what's in here. Like, I have a lot of troops in the middle of the board I would love to pull into here. Because all I got to do is get this. Oh, my God. By the way, Jesus, I, 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 the tips are coming in and gift subs like crazy. Thank you guys so much for the support today. It's day one, stream, first stream in the new house. I'm very appreciative of you guys. Um, big shout out, I guess, to Hippo and Chainfire, of course, for uh, their support over the last year. Part of the reason I'm able to uh, upgrade from a shitty basement. So, very thankful for you guys. If you could change one thing about Risk Online overnight, what would it be? A sandbox mode. Like a well-designed sandbox mode would be what I would change. Okay. No? Why did it have to come back? I want to move through there with my stack, dog. Doyle rules. Thank you. W1 Pro with the gift sub. White bot, if it adds here, could hit either of the fives. If it left the two here, I was going to come through, though. I'm actually starting to think there might not be a cat back here. Oh, my God. 
Oh my god, this game is ridiculous. Room 101 on the subs? What's that mean? Yeah, so not new map. No, I wouldn't go for new map. So I think we have a lot of maps. The problem is most of the maps aren't viable to play competitively. And we could probably change that with a sandbox mode if we could load into that map, set spawn a certain way, blizzards a certain way, and then be like, this is a copy, and we use this for a competitive setting. And then everybody gets an equal spawn on an odd map, and it's, it's neat, unique ways to play it, right? If we could do stuff like that, we could utilize the current maps better. And then, yeah, of course, new maps would be better. Better designed maps for competitive would be good, too. The devs, the devs like, they get a... They want to create fun, interesting maps and, and themes, right? Like uh, Viking dice and Viking maps. Uh, space dice and space maps. Whereas the way I would look at it is... Because they're, they're not trying to make competitively viable maps. They just... What's fun and cool that people might like. What is this? That was weird. Okay. So I got a bunch of new maps that like could be designed... Four competitive would be amazing. Bigger lobbies? Yeah, eight-player games would be sick. Eight-player games with progressive cards? I mean, then the trades go up even faster. That would actually make Progressive World Dom more viable if you could have more people. This guy needs to shut up. Captains. General Kong from Spain already pissed me off by laughing too much. We got Granderson. He's a grand... person. Uh, we got Disturbed Chaos Yellow Botted after that, so he lost his cat. Bruce Wayne. You probably heard that name before. Well, there he is. I'm going to lose this five at some point. Do I bring this together and then bring this in? I, what do I do? It's fixed, right? If the bot trades... Ugh. Trades aren't coming through right now. Nonya tipped four dollars and twenty cents. Nonya, thank you for the tip, bro. Thirty-second timers would be cool. Fifty-second turn timers is cool. Uh, turn timers. Turn timers set up in a way. Oh man. Turn timer is set up in a way that uh, you get like 20 second default time and then every time you take a territory you get a little bit more time back, like half a second or three quarters of a second or something. That would be decent. Blue's probably very sad to see that, Black Capital. There should be more maps like uh, King Dynasty with the wall and more defending dice. The horse in Troy needs a stat change. Yes, yeah, that'd be cool too. My friend is a strategy game nerd, but is newish to Risk. He suggested a mode that's in between the fixed and prog in terms of game speed. Thoughts? I pretty much any any new modes. I'd be I'd love to hear ideas for him. And too bad we could we don't have them. What just happened here? Hmm. No trade. Honey Podhead, what? Replays with no fog? Another cool idea, yeah. Yeah, what's up, Philippe? We're in the new place, yeah. Shit. White bot trades on three. Kills my four stack. You know it's coming. Oh, yeah. I wonder if the middle is all white has and I could maybe kill it and take its four cards. Probably not. Let's be real. Is this three on one attack up and let my come four come in? That'd be cool. I'm a little concerned with people having stacks behind me, honestly. Let's see. Hey, hey, hey. Doyle rules! Jesus, today's crazy, man. You guys are absolute legends. Jesus. Okay. Oh. 
I wonder if that's all purple has, by the way. Oh, what a weird game. I love my position. I love my position. What is this? Okay, cool. Did you get destroyed by Black? What did you just do? Did Black take his capital? Dude, Carter with the 100 bits. Thank you, man. I love me some Alcatraz capitals. No, Blue started with five and traded and put everything behind me. Black's going to take his capital. Black already took his capital. He's got the cap and the bonus. So how did Blue start with five? Blue has a different cap? Blue has a cap somewhere else. <clears throat> Doyle rules! Okay. He's trying to kill white. He fails the white kill, maybe? Hmm. White trades. Imagine it traded here and hit this seven. Oh my god, I would love it. Hit this seven, doggy. Was plus two in the bottom right. I mean, he's got a cap somewhere. I don't know why he put all his troops here. That was a very bad play. I thought purple was going to hit his two stack for a card. Okay. Blue has no trade. The question is, can I pull this off? Probably not. Purple kill would be nice, but uh, well, what if I do this? Dude, as if. No trade on three? Imagine no trade on three. My dice were decent too. Blue gets the yellow kill. He's going to have four cards. He'll be on five cards next turn. I only get one card off purple. Okay, he backed off. Wait, how's he back in here? How's black getting 13 then? Black has three capitals in the right side. Blue's still in here. Doyle rules. What the fuck is happening? Jesus. I mean, I have to hit this cap. Blue has a trade. Fix on this map is fucking wild. It is wild. Dude, Carter with the gift sub. Carter with two gift subs. Hippo with a gift sub. Thank you guys. Bonte with the prime sub. Thank you guys so much. Okay. I'm guarded by the bot. I am guarded by the bot.
Carter 1996 cheered X-1000, kill that purple mother fricker anyways. Law. Carter! Language, bro! Wow! Oh my god, I wasn't expecting that, uh, that from you. Jesus, wow! Wow! So you guys might think it'd be worth letting Purple get a third card and stuff, but it's actually more worth just taking this bonus and stacking. Oh, he's... Why, why did Purple survive in the back corner and have a trade on three and ram Dingley? Why? How is that even possible that could happen? Oh, that's how. That's how. That's exactly how. No trade for white. You suck, kid. What's up, John? Purple instantly skipped. Oh, he did. Yeah, you're right. Okay, I'll just kill him then. That's fine. Nobody! Oh, there we go. Suck my balls. I should have slided, but I just want to send a message, right? Doyle rules. You're damn right at Doyle rules. Let's go. Woo! What do you do? <laughs> GG? I mean, it's fixed capitals, though. I mean, blue dies. It'll be me versus black. What if black and I... Oh, no. What if black gets this cap? Then I'm screwed. I need blue to survive. I need to kill white on five. I hope white has uh, no trade. If white has no trade, that's really good. I need to punish black. If black commits big and loses, like I need to go in like immediately. Knocks my three out. Still starts with 13. Yeah. Seven, a two. Is he coming through? If white doesn't trade, I'm gonna try to make shit happen right now. I have to, before black gets. Uh, if black wins this battle with blue, black will have more than me. And I can't do anything about it. It's going to trade because I, I I don't get easy. <gasps> okay. Woo -woo. Let's go. No, I want blue to live for now. Okay. What is this? Oh, wowzers. Black has two capitals in this bonus. Okay, so what I want to know... Black... Black put a cap in upper, upper lavatory? And then the very next turn he had this bonus with two caps. Black must have been in, like, clerks while two idiots had capitals. They rolled their capitals and then Black just took it. They just full sent suicided and Black was just there on turn one with his eight troops to start and just went, thank you, that was free. And he's been snowballing ever since. I opened his cap, but I wanted to see what was going on. I didn't know what he committed up here with blue. That's not getting through a 38 cap. The Doyle rules! Yeah, baby. He's gonna open. Hey, hey, hey. Who rules? Doyle rules! Wait, is he double slamming? No, he's just going all the way around. He's taking everything. Okay. Triple dudes, baby! Bye.
back with dancing. It's fucking Bruce Wayne, bro. It is Bruce Wayne. Let's go. Okay. Mm. I'm not gonna lie to you, that was horrendous dice. I was only hitting ones. Eh, I wouldn't say horrendous. I lost three out of seven, but still pretty bad. So what do I start with, by the way? Black gets 13, I get 19? I get more than him. Who's got three capitals? Blue? No, Black does. So Black has a capital in Upper Lavatory. And Black has two capitals, one in Second Floor Hall, and another one in one of these places. And he's got this bonus. And then Blue's cap is in Passage. If Blue's one doesn't get open, I think I might come out and then card block Black. That'd be funny. Oh, he's gonna card block me? I mean, it's fixed. Card block doesn't matter too much. Oh, I get 20. Let's go. What was his fortify, I wonder? Good dice. Ah, interesting. Was that all off cap or most? I mean, that is risky. If I take black out, if black, dude, if I, if blue's trapped and black is fully off cap and I get all of this, blue gets five a turn. I hold this for one turn. I can like, I'll, I'll be able to hold it forever. I just card skip forever while these guys sit in here. Card trade in here infinitely. It's fixed, bro. Does Black try a double slam on Blue's capital, maybe? He knows he can't get into me. You started the turn with 13 territories? Yeah, yeah, that was the extra troop. That's why I got 20. You're right. He's putting everything outside. There's no way he doesn't fortify back. I mean, okay. Slider blitz. Slider blitz. One, two, three, four. Four cards. Suck it. <laughs> I want him to come off cap, right? Well played to blue. And a fist bump. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, blue. I'm going to put black in the dumpster. Come on out. He's got a card in here. Okay. Does this fortify happen or is he fortify back? Okay, cool. I might as well start pulling these threes from the back out, right? These are never getting used unless I lose this, which would be terrible. That is the smartest stupid move I've ever seen. Which one? <laughs> I wish there was a progressive card mode where the trades increased with kills, not trades. So trades are worth enough late when players hold the board. Interesting. Dang, why couldn't I make it a 69 cap? Because I'm, I'm, I'm putting in work, bro. 
As long as I don't open Blue's cap, I can pretty much just do this. And at some point, I'll be able to put enough here that Blue won't want to deal with it, and I'll put enough here that Black won't want to deal with it, and they'll trade in here. But I will also hold first floor. So if you guys are wondering what I'm doing, I'm putting myself in a position where at some point I'll take first floor. Black gets 13 to blues 5, but they're each getting trades. Black has to keep putting stuff here, or at some point he's going to uh, lose it. He's also got to be worried about putting it up here, or he loses it to blue. This is fun. I like it, I like it. How black cat? Yeah, so black capped back in upper lavatory and blue capped in passage. Funny enough, black has two caps down here and neither of them were his starting capital. Literally, I guess yellow and purple or yellow and white or two people down here just went to war immediately and black got all of it for free. No, white capped here. So it was yellow and purple down here. That's their caps. And they immediately suicided each other. And right after yellow's turn, black just took everything. Yellow and purple. We saw purple unhappy. Yeah, purple is a little unhappy. Double attack blue and put a small stack to encourage blue to open your cap. I could... Is black actually getting card blocked now? Yeah, if black's getting card blocked, that's even better to trade with blue for now. Yeah, yeah. I like it. And he knows I'm stacking up big for black, right? So blue's cool with this. Why not take five more territories from black so I gain one more troop per turn? Black might have a hundred stack in guards room waiting for me to open. So right now I know his stack's not there. I mean, if it is, I guess I could hit it, but... I'm bringing all my threes out. I'm getting prepared. But you can, you can definitely make the argument I take some more territories and sit in here instead. Definitely. Because black has what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 territories. And a plus 4 and 3 caps. Yeah, what is it? Plus 4 and 3 caps is 10. And then 3 for a turn for territory. So I don't make him get less. I would just get... I could get one more troop if I took 3 territories. 2 more troops if I put this stack here. Which I will at some point. <clears throat> black rolled... Black took Blue's cap. He's killing Blue now. He got through Blue's cap. Jesus. That's all he's got left? You definitely don't want to open that 175, dog. That's all he's got left after he cleans the corners? He's going to trade and go back to cap? <clears throat> Can I get in or no? I don't have a plus two that makes sense. Can I get in? Yes, I can. What's up, buddy? Oh my god. Uh, I'm an idiot. That's fine. Uh, I gets five cards. Slider fail! Skill issue. Yep. I was trying to be real precise because I didn't quite have the amount of troops I wanted.
know what happens if we don't slide her? We can just do this. Now we're getting really strong. This position looks pretty powerful. What do you guys think? I might have the edge. Yeah, I might have them. I might have them. We'll see. Boom, we get to save the wild card. 329. Does he have a second cat with troops on it? Probably not. Powerbunga, baby! Good game, well played. Good game. Hell yeah, man. You could have a 1,000 cap. He had a 1K cap, oh my god. This position benches 300 pounds. Oh my god. What a bench press that would be. All right, we'll take it. Fixed Alcatraz, baby, I'll take it. Black was a master, Bruce Wayne, and General Kong was a master, the purple player. So two masters, an intermediate, and a novice, Granderson. What a sick position we got. Nobody really capped behind us. We got that bot cap. And then soon, all we had to do was clean it out and hold it for a couple turns. Uh, Black could have definitely fought better. He didn't have to suicide into blue, but I guess he felt like the writing was on the wall. So uh, maybe maybe it was. So he, he took his best shot at second at the very least and uh, hoped I screwed up on a cap roll or something. But uh, yeah, great game. Thank you for joining until the end of the video. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll catch you in the next one.